sleepless nights for people living near the Ed Koch Queensboro Bridge. They say the honking and traffic noise is worse than ever, and they tell CBS 2's Matt Kozar they want the city to do something about it. The blaring of car horns is part of the symphony that is New York City. But people who live on the Manhattan side of the Ed Koch Queensboro Bridge say the noise level from traffic has become unbearable. We're just getting more things added to our area. Uh, they're beeping even during our interview. Well, yes, and this goes on like this all the time. Naomi Pearl has lived in the neighborhood for three decades and says it's not just the horns. Frustrated residents are cursing and shouting at drivers from their apartment windows. Chopper 2 recorded this bird's eye view of the traffic, which causes gridlock from 59th to 64th streets between 1st and 2nd Avenue. Google Maps shows Friday rush hour traffic at a standstill. 175,000 vehicles travel across the Ed Koch Queensboro Bridge every day. And according to the city, that makes it the most utilized of the East River bridges. Longtime resident Barry Schneider blames Uber for contributing to the congestion and traffic cops for not properly managing the flow of traffic. He believes a toll on the bridge would help. If we had a toll on the Queensboro Bridge, one third of those vehicles would no longer be coming into the Midtown Manhattan. We asked the Department of Transportation's Manhattan Borough President for an on-camera interview, but instead she sent us this statement. We are looking at various ways that can mitigate the traffic, including signal timing. We will work with the NYPD regarding enforcement about honking, which is not allowed unless in emergency situations. Searching for a solution to a noisy problem. On the east side, Matt Kozar, CBS 2 News.